wonderful artist. My name is Gabby and welcome to Radiant Art Inspirations. If you're new, this channel is all about easy, fun, and fast face paint tutorials every single week. In today's class, we have a treat for you. We're going to compare snowflake stencils to painting snowflakes by hand. Both of them have their pros and their cons. When it comes to painting snowflakes by hand, it can take a little bit longer, but you do get to add your own perfect style to your work. And when you use a stencil, it can be a lot faster. But if that person just moves a centimeter, your whole design is smudged and you have to start over. We're going to be using the Snowflake Stencils by Pink Power, which is in the holiday set, and I will put the link in the description below of the previous video talking about all of the must-have Christmas supplies this year and all the upcoming years, because we're going to be using those supplies today in this video. Enough talk, let's get started. These are the supplies we are using today. Look at that bluish aesthetic. It's kind of nice. All right, so with the sponge, you load it with a pearl white to sponge around the eye, the eyelid, and a little bit below the eye as well. And then apply any clear glitter that you have. This one is Iridescent by Mama Clown. Then with a number two round brush, load in a shade of blue. Here we mixed navy blue with winter blue to create these snowflakes. Add three to the face, and here is the base of how to do it, but we're going to show you a close-up version of exactly how to finish the entire snowflake. Here is how it looks. Adding four backwards teardrops, and the rest are also going to be backward teardrops. But if you don't know how to do these, later in the video we're going to show you how to do a snowflake with normal teardrops, and a slight practice on how to create backwards teardrops. So. Stay tuned and don't fast forward. Okay, so now that you know how to do it, we're gonna do that exact technique on the face, just like how it is here in that same shade of blue that I told you about. Now adding some little bit of dots around the design just to kind of bring it together, make it look a little bit less naked, and then adding glitter to the design. Here we are using fairy snuff and then adding some stick on pastel tiny gems on the inside of the snowflake. Here is the finished look. It was really fast, easy, and it's beautiful. Now we're gonna show you the snowflakes using normal teardrops. you like these kinds of tutorials, then don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so that you never miss any of our videos. And now that the holiday season is finally here, we have some fantastic, easy, fun, and fast face paint tutorials for the Christmas season just for you. Every design that we have right here that involves face painting we post step-by-step -step photos on our Instagram at Radiant Art Inspirations because let's say you just don't want to watch the video or you forgot the steps, don't worry. We have you covered to make it easier on you where you can just save all the step-by-steps on your cell phone and I get to be on your phone forever. Isn't that... Isn't that great? Follow the Instagram account to make your life just a little bit easier. The same base, adding glitter, and now time for the stencils. Here we're using the stencils from the holiday set from Pink Power, which is from Silly Farm, and we're adding three snowflakes on the side of the face, just like in the previous design. When you are using these stencils, don't take it off without adding glitter. If you add glitter directly on with the stencil, the glitter will only be on that area versus kind of just 
everywhere. Then here we're using Angelic Ice by Vivid Glitter and the same pastel gems for the center. Here is the finished look and take a look at it with a comparison of doing it by hand. Do you see any differences? Which one do you like more? Which one do you think you would use at your next event? Let me know in the comments below. And for everyone that stayed all the way through, here is a bonus clip on a separate way to doing snowflakes. Don't forget to eat your vegetables and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.